All right, Vidi, what's good with you, bro? What's going on, fam? How are you? Definitely, man. I'm good. A lot of good shit on the way, man. So, Facts. you know, you getting a status update interview, very first time, man. A lot of the people want to know where are you from and how was it growing up? Well, you know, originally, I'm from Gary, Indiana, East Side, 15th Avenue. Right. I grew up, threw up, you know what I'm saying? Right. And, uh, you know, I stayed out in Gary till I was about 18 and a half, 19. Okay. And then um, I moved to what I would like to consider my second home. Because, you know, I stayed there for about the same amount of time as the second half of my life, you know. Right. In my 30s, you know, 18 years here, you know, 15 years there, off and on. But I moved to Atlanta from that point. Okay. After some shit went down, you know, when I was a youngster. Right. But, um, you know, all that shit, you know. In the wind, man. Right. Yeah, we ain't gonna speak on the negative shit. So, like, okay, now you're doing music. What made you start rapping, and what keeps you motivated? Because it took a minute, you know. You're an OG in the game. So what made you start pursuing music? Well, you know, um, i never forget, man. I was, like, in the third grade. And this dude came to me. You know, we used to have what they call a sock op. I don't know if you remember. Sock yeah, I remember that. Yeah, we had those, drink. yeah. So, anyway, what keeps you motivated with doing music, bro? You know what, um, um, I guess what really keeps me motivated is the fact that I really love doing this, you know what I'm saying? I do this for free. Right. I don't make music because I want to be some famous artist or because I want to be rich because, hell, I already get money, you know what I'm saying? I already take care of my family, you know what I'm saying? I already take care of other families. Right. So what I get out of this is just the satisfaction of, like, knowing that I made a good song to me. Right. You know what I mean? I don't make songs for... I don't want to say it like that, like I don't make it for the fans, but I make a song, and if it sounds good to me, I'm cool with it. Right. If y'all like it, then that's even better. Okay. Definitely. Okay. So now your energy, man, when you perform, when you do your videos, man, what, what motivates you to do the different shit, man? Tee up, you're eating weed, you're doing all type of crazy ass shit. I'm sure by the time this interview comes out, everybody will have peeped you. <laughs> right. So right. 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 what makes you do this crazy shit, man? Like... Well, you know, entertainment sales, man, and people, right. you know, everybody's the same, you know. Shout out to the little homies, you know, with the guns and the bitches and the shit in their video, you know, that's right. cool. I, I, I'm going to do all that, too. But, you know, who's doing that in their video? Nobody right now. You know, maybe a couple of people, but, you know, I just want to be different because right. I'm a character, you know, at the end of the day. Right. Okay. So now, do you have any mixtapes, any new videos coming out? What can we expect from Viddy in the future? Well, you know, um, I got my new video, which is the Feeling Good, the Good Feeling song. You know okay. We just put that together today, you know. Right. Shout out to Status Update, you know, real exclusive. Okay. Shout out to A Mario Films, you know what I'm saying, for putting this movement together with me. Right. And um, that's dropping on the 14th, which is uh, Valentine's Day at 5.55. It's going to be okay. on all streaming platforms. Okay. And, um, you know, first things first is YouTube. You know what I'm right. saying? I always start there. Okay. Definitely. Okay. So now, basically, with a lot of artists, man, you know, I came up in the early 2000s hip-hop, you know, where artists was into a whole lot of shit like doing movies. You had athletes doing movies and right. music. You had artists doing, uh, you know, music, you know, shit like that. Are you ever going to do any movies, commercials, you know, can we see you doing shit that's not music? Like, oh, yeah, can you yeah. do some shit with Kevin Hart? That's you know? actual factual. Can actual. you do some shit with Martha Stewart, you know, actually, a cooking you know channel? Saying, actually, you know, I actually you know? the fuck on this old bitch that look like Martha Stewart. Okay. And cook like a <laughs> you, know what I mean? yeah. you know what I'm saying? She used to take her teeth out and numb me to motherfucking death, you hear me? Right. But, uh, no, but, um, I actually am, you know, I'm on that, um, I've been, um, in several plays, you know, throughout right. the course of my career because, um, I've been a thespian, you know, since a young man. Right. For those who don't know what that is, you know, that's the technical term for an actor. Right. You know what I mean? But, um, uh, that's actually one of my other goals, you know, as well as being, a, you know, uh, a director as far as, you know, movies or whatnot, if I could, mm -hmm. you know, on my Tyler Perry thing, you know what I mean? Right. Okay. Okay, definitely. All right, so now I know that you're a weed guy. You know, definitely love weed. Okay, so what do you need to get you doing music in the studio? Because a lot of guys need weed, liquor, like Henny and shit like that. Uh, what do you think are the three things that you need to make a song in the studio? Well, you know, I hate to say it because I don't want to act like 
drugs is what motivates me, but you know, it does stimulate my mind and it calms right. me down if I'm having a bad day, mm -hmm. especially, um, you know, after working and whatnot, you know. Right. But um, I'm off that whole nine to five kick now, you know what I'm saying? It's just strictly music and branding. Okay. But um, I need my weed, you know what I'm saying? Right. I know in my song, I talk about the lean and, you know, I like Molly. I ain't talking about Cyrus. These are things that I've partaked in in my lifetime. Right. Now, will I just... Am I on a molly now? No, but if you bring three bitches around, two, three bitches, and something finna go down, something strange, and I'm popping that bitch, you heard? Right, 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 okay. It is what it is. Okay, okay. So now, definitely, um, so now we got a Mario film visual in you, you know, right. the good feeling track. You know, we got another video probably on the way, I'm sure. Oh, yes, yeah, two weeks, we're gonna drop another. I, I right. got three Booty Club songs. Okay. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to figure which one it's gonna be. I'm thinking it's gonna be the OT. I got a joint called OT. Talk okay. about the strippers that's going out of town, getting that money. Shout out to all the strippers getting their money. Right. You know what I'm saying? It's about you, baby girl. I ain't here bashing you. You know what I'm saying? I'm here working with you, baby. Teamwork make the dream work, baby. I'm gonna put right. the ism in your head and put you on this motherfucker's scroll and let you get to it. You understand? Right. Okay. So now, what advice do you have to the young cats, you know, looking up to you, trying to come up in the game and wanting to be in the position like, you know, obviously the events that we were at, you know, um, you know, shit like that. What advice do you have for the young cats coming up in Gary, Indiana that want to, you know, be in that position one day in hip hop? Definitely. I, I, I want to tell you, man, try to stand out. Right. You know what I'm saying? Watch what people are doing and do the total opposite, but only more so in the sense of how you're making your music. Right. You know, sometimes it's just good to follow the trend, find what's popping, and, you know, hone it to your own skill. Mm -hmm. But just stay consistent, you know what I mean? That's one yeah, thing definitely. that I lacked at, throughout life, which is why I'm at the point where I'm older, quote right. unquote, trying to make it. Because it's not that I didn't lack, you know, uh, consistency. It's just I didn't want it as much as I do now and the reason that I want it now. Uh, take it, you know, uh, pay your DJ, man. I can't say right. that and stress that enough. Pay your DJ. Get your cameraman and get your visuals. Right. People want to see visuals, you know what I'm saying? Right. And you ain't necessarily got to fake it till you make it. People always say that. No, show you till you make it. And then you can do the big shit, you know what I'm saying? Very true. Because what you got popping is what's popping. Fuck what everybody else doing, you know what I'm saying? Okay, cool. Be different. Right. All right, now if anybody wants to reach out to you for any type of business, where to find you at? Instagram, Facebook? Well, you can follow me at uh, on Instagram at, at Vitty247, that's V-I-T-Y, okay. 247, Vitty like city. Uh, you can send me a dollar twenty-five to my cash app, you heard me, for donation, you know, to help me keep on staying saucy and drip to the toe tip. Right. You feel me? At the same thing, Vitty247, right. Twitter, Vitty247.